For practice it's self check 5.22 day morgans we are given the following options and the following options are for the question which of the following is a properly reversed version of the boolean expression according to day morgan's law this is our boolean expression right here and basically the um day morgan's law is that all of these statements reign true so when we start looking at these we'll we'll look at them piece by piece we'll look at this part then this part then this part so for this first part we have two is equal to three and we want a reversed version of it so the reverse version of this is two does not equal three that means a is out b is out c looks good d also looks good and e is out so now we're left with c and d as our options we can look at the second part and we know that whatever is on our left side right here has to be one less it has it can be any negative number from negative infinity to one less than what's on our right side and then our right side is going to be a certain number to infinity um, greater than uh, this number on the left side but if we flip this that means that this left side would have to include this number so instead of looking just like negative 1 has to be greater than 5 we're gonna also have negative 1 is greater than or equal to 5 that means only C can be our correct answer and this is further proven by the is prime part where we have is prime here and the opposite of is prime is is not prime so we're just gonna throw a not in front of it and the only thing with a not in front of it is this part right here and since that's the only one if we click C and submit we can see that this is the correct answer to this problem